Hey there, it's Mark. Oh man, these are terrible. Hey there, it's Mark. You might be used to color shifters coming in packages like this, single blister packs basically. And when you apply water, it has degrees of color change. On the back, you can see two different colors. Here it shows two different colors as an example. I bought this car too. I have, I have a, a big collection of these color shifters. I don't make a video. I'm gonna wait to raise them actually. Hello, can I help you? Hello? Fair warning, you might open these up and have these types of reactions. Oh, look at this, the paint. The paint is stuck to the bag. That's not good. That's not good. You can see all that green paint. Ew, look at that paint. Oh my God, this is, this looks bad. This is terrible. Look, the paint, the, the wheel is connected to the body. It's like it was painted at the same time. Does it roll? It doesn't even roll. Oh, it feels yucky, it feels pasty. <laughs> Anyways, I was in the store and they seen this display box of Hot Wheels color shifters. I bought some, but the store wouldn't let me keep the display box to show you. They did let me take pictures, so we'll look at the pictures first. Hot Wheels color reveal. Two cars, it looks like each container has two cars. Hey, wait a second, look at the cars. Look at the one on the right. I wonder if that's one of my favorite cars to collect. They use the same image on the back of the display box. That sure looks like one of my favorite cars. Well, this does have a copyright of 2020 on the box. I found them July of 2021. This panel explains the color shifters. You know, you know the drill. You put the cars in different temperatures of water and you get three different results. Hey, check it out. A side panel shows two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve 12 cars. I should say models. MIG rig is a truck. Speed box is a van. Look on top in the circle. Looks like a number one. I wonder if they're going to make this a series. Remember those two per container? Look how it has two cars in each square. El Superfasto with MIG rig. Oh, El Superfasto. They, that has like a mask. That, I wonder if it's going to have that removable mask or if it's just a one piece body. Power Rocket, that's a great car. In yellow, Ren and Rig, Shadow Jet 2. Wow, where you been, Shadow Jet 2? Nitro Tailgater with RD08. Oh yeah, racing drone. Here's the orange section. You have Growler and Tigre. Then you have, oh, Baseline. Oh yeah, Acceleracers. Oh, Baseline paired with Spinebuster. Spinebuster's my car. No, it's not, it's my car. If you know anything about Hot Wheels mystery cars, they tend to have a code. Sure enough, on each container they have a production code. But look to the right, I found numbers. You know what else they tend to do? They tend to put the cars in order on the box. It's pretty safe to say these would be number one. Then it would go two, three, four, five, six. Or does it go one, two, three, four, five, six? I don't know, but we're going to find out because I found six different numbers. So I got one of each number. And remember that chart? I don't know if it's counting one, two, three, four, five, six, or one, two, three, four, five, six. If it is in order, no matter which way you go, one is here, six is here. And since six has the car, not this one, you don't be the chart. Remember the chart, number six. Since number six had my favorite car, I got two number sixes. I hope it's right because these were $10.99 each. Normally color shifters are $4.99 per car. Well, they add a dollar because it's in this plastic container. And there's your code number one. If I forget to show you each time, it's on top of each one. Now I found it in I found that in a display box. Uh, it has a little hang tag, but check it out. It has a that's pretty interesting. I don't know if that has anything to do with the product or is it just to have this to where it stays down for production or is it a safety thing to where it's a breathing hole for a kid in case for a safety reason? I don't know. So they have all that information on these containers as well. Contains two cars. Uh, <laughs> look, 
They can sell these in a lot of countries. They have all sorts of languages. This is not exclusive to the USA. As a matter of fact, other countries probably already had it. I showed you the copyright date. Uh, let's move on. <laughs> I found a tab on the bottom. There's a spot for you to tear it. There you go, right there. Let's go ahead and check number one. And I'm hoping number one was uh, that wrestling car. It was El Superfesto. Because if it's true, that means they're in order. So we have a little container. <laughs> so much for that. Where's the top end of that? I found it right here. I wonder if it's going to line up with that hole every time. Uh, we'll check on the next ones. And, I, oh, you know what? You don't. You might not have to t take, take the whole thing off. This is just on top. So actually, if you tear it on top, you can keep it if you want. Here we go. What's this like? What is this? Color shifters. Color reveal. Now look, uh, I normally wouldn't buy these because I like to collect certain cars. I thought it would be neat to do a video. There's all that legal information. There's all the cars again. There's that number one. So like if there's a series two, I'm not going to be buying every car. You know, you know why I bought it. You know why I bought it, right? That's what I like to collect. Excuse me, you're in my way. Oh look, they pack them in. But I was wondering, all this space, is there going to be something in there? Is it going to be plastic holding two cars in place? Uh, bubble wrap, and sure enough, green. Green was on top, right? The top color. Wow, lots of bubble wrap. Let's see. Mig rig. I can see it already. Come out, come out wherever you are. Well, you have it in the bag, and then it's it. Never mind. This one's all super fast, so. Yeah, there you go. Well, we got to look at this now because I talked about it being a former wrestling car and you can pop off the body. Oh, look at this. The paint. The paint is stuck to the bag. That's not good. That's not good. You can see all that green paint. Ugh, look, it's ugly. Look, it's, it messed up my paint. I don't know if you can see that. Look, look, it's, look, 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 look right there. Look right there. That's not designed. Oh, that's terrible. Wow, that's terrible. Look, coming right off. Anyways, mm, let's see. This one used to be able to un unhook it. This part unhooks, and then this part comes across. This is the mask. Let's see if that still does it. And then look, I tried to un un unclip it, and look, the paint is coming off. Sure enough, there you go. You can still take it off. And there's the two parts to El Super Fasto. El Super Fasto, it's kind of like a wrestling. They have a Lucha Libre, I think it's called and Mexican wrestlers, and they wear masks. Hold on, hold on, and <laughs> guess what? If you've bought color shifters before, you know, there's been color shifters that have had three different colors. So you would have like uh, hot, or regular, and then hot, and then cold, and you get three different colors. So when I seen this, I thought it was three different colors. These are different, only two different colors. Guess what, you're supposed to this is not to get the color. Look how dirty the water is. Yeah, you're supposed to wash off that sloppy layer of paint. Okay, El Superfesto and MIG rig. Here we go. I might be able, you can't see. Hang on. The water is a little cloudy. There's, it's dissolved. Look, look at it. The outer layer of paint is dissolving. So let's just give it a little wash. Get it to come off. Oh, I see white already. Look at the water. It's, it's totally milky. I'm going to have to change the water every time so that you can see the color. Hey, look, MIG rig is like a yellow with red stripes. That's with the regular color. And then here's El Super Fasto. I need to wash them a little bit better. Let's pop off the mask. It looks like I need to wash in there a little bit. Oh, yeah, that's going to clean up pretty good. I went ahead and got ready for the next car because I took these in the house and then I cleaned these under a faucet. It's uh, much easier to clean them under a faucet, but I left this just to show you. You see the green paint, it gets stuck in the, the tiny areas like that. So if, if you get these, then that's what you're going to have to do. It'll come off. You just have to uh, <laughs> squirt the water, have the hose blast in there pretty good. Now I just realized I got to clean this up because this is going to dirty my... Well, let's go ahead. Okay, this is hot water, not hot. Whatever the temperature is, they uh, they say in the instructions. Let's go ahead and check it out. 
Now the hotter water is supposed to be one temperature, <laughs> which it's not. Uh, maybe it's because my room temperature water was warm. I don't know. Maybe I'll leave it for a little bit. I'm not getting any difference. Let's just leave it in there. Let's check out El Superfesto. You know what? <laughs> I don't see I don't see any color change. Let's go ahead and try the cold water. Now I have ice in here so that you know that this is the cold side. Besides, you probably can see condensation on the side. Here we go. Darkening up. Put it against the side. You can see it better, huh? There you go, two colors. Come on, a super fesso. I wonder what color you're going to be. Hey, they both kind of turned orange. Wasn't that the first color that they were before we uh, washed them off? Kind of orange with a yellow stripe. A super fesso. There you go. That's like tiger stripes on the side there. Let's go ahead and bring it over. Put it back in the warm water. Maybe my uh, maybe my room temperature water was uh, a little bit on the warm side, or maybe that's just the other color. There you go, number two. There you go, number two. And sure enough, it lines up with the the tag again. I'm showing you that because it might do it every time. It might not. You will find out at the same time as I will, because I have not looked at those yet. This time, there we're going to do it faster. Yellow. Wait. Oh, yellow. So that means it's counting down because otherwise it was green, green, right, right? So this is a green, yellow, orange. So that's the other green one. Should be. I can't, I, can I? No, I gotta wait. There you go. Oh man, these are terrible. Oh, they look terrible. Absolutely terrible. Look at the yellow paint in the bag. Wow, just terrible. It looks like some kid just got some paint and just colored it. And, and if you're a kid, I'm not insulting you. You know what I'm talking about. Shadow Jet 2, Shadow Jet U. Look at that paint. Let's go ahead and clean off Ren and Rig and Shadow Jet 2. Here comes Ren and Rig, Shadow Jet 2. Let's go ahead and clean them off a bit. Water's going to turn all yellow. I'm going to I'm going to wash off the first three, but then when I do the last three, you've already seen the color of the water. Hey, these had the yellow outer paint, but Shadow Jet is orange. Is this still warm? It's been a while. I went in the house to clean them off. Yeah, see, seems like room temperature actually for me. I'm just saying for me, turning out to be the same color. By the way, this, this is not like a bare metal color. It is gray. Yeah, when I wash it, it's turning out to be the same color. Let's go ahead and che check the cold, ice cold water. Hopefully it's still cold. This is taking a while. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that had a pretty significant, yeah, the water's still chilled. There's a piece of ice floating in here still. Let's check out Rin and Rig. Oh, pretty cool color. This was kind of a dark greenish. Still need to leave it in a while. It looks like it has some spots. Pretty cool, like lightning bolts on the side. And let's check out the truck. Eh, just fairly simple design. Next. That one's green, right? Wait, go here, go to the hole. Oh yeah, so, so far three for three lines up. Here we go. To be honest with you, I might take these back to the store. I rarely ever take anything back. Did I show you it was number three? Well, it's orange. Wow, this looks bad. This is terrible. Look, the paint, the, the wheel is connected to the body. It's like it was painted at the same time. Does it roll? It doesn't even roll. Oh my, what a, what a terrible, this is disgusting. Wow, just absolutely disgusting. Another one? Yep, yeah. boy. 
Look, it doesn't even it doesn't even move around in the baggie. You know why? Because it was stuck in there when the paint was still wet. And it stuck to the bag. Okay, let's wash off number three, Tigre and Growler. Hey, where'd they go? Okay, I cleaned the water again. Growler looks pretty cool. Kind of looks like a dog. Looks like it, uh, it's got spots like a Dalmatian. And there's Tigre. Yeah, pretty unique graphics. That's tap water right out of my tap. So, mm, it's Luke. It's, I don't know, room temperature. This is kind of hot. Uh, remember, use the temperature that they recommend. Let's go ahead and check it out. Might not see any change at all like I did before. You know what, see, uh, I don't think the warm water matters. When you clean them off, it's basically gonna be warm enough. Now let's head over to the cold water. I chilled it up again, added some ice. Let's see. Oh yeah, there you go. Kind of interesting, kind of a uh, uh, olive drab color. And here we go. That one got dark, kind of brown. Pretty cool color combination with the orange engine in the back. Hey, look at the number on the side, K9. Get it, K9? Up front, this is number 68. That's Hot Wheels were created in 1968. And this is kind of like a dog collar. If you haven't seen this car before, check out its teeth. Let me get it cold again. Let's see how fast the color changes if I use my warm fingers. Well, let me hold this. And while I'm holding this, let's go ahead and pull out Tigre. Check out the deco pattern on the side. Okay, Growler. There you go. Change back. Oh, it's still cold. It's still cold from the cold water. It's, it's changing back to the cold color presentation. Four. Oh, Spine Buster. Oh, no. <laughs> I, might, I might have to keep Spine Buster, though. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> up, 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 up. Oh, I forgot to show you. Oh, four. Here we go. Oh, four. Oh, look. No, uh, no baggies. Here, this makes sense, right? You have nice little, uh, nice little things uh, instead of bubble wrap. This makes more sense because the, when they put it in, pop it here, pop it here, put it in the thing, seal the top. There you go. Let's see if uh, it makes a difference with the paint. The paint looks smoother, as a matter of fact. No, nope, right here. You see this line? It's the paint is no, it's moving. It looked like it was stuck to the outside. Power rocket. Oh, wheels are rolling. That's a good sign. No, but it feels it feels yucky. It feels pasty. <laughs> Anyways, move on. Speed box. I'm sorry if I was a little low on the camera. I might have been because I was looking at the car. Look, look, paint. Look at this paint in the axle. I mean, in between the wheel well. Wow, disgusting. Number five. There you go. Number five. There you go. Nice. I like it like that. There you go. Mm. Ugly. Boy, that looks terrible. Jeez. And look at the paint in the wheel wells. Look at that. Wow. Wow. What? Oh, my. Wow. Look at that. This is just disgusting. Poor racing drone. Poor dude. Look at that. Oh, no. Here we go. We already know. We already know Spine Buster and Spine Buster. I forgot it was paired with another Accelerator model, right? I forget which one. Mm, Spine Buster. I forgot it was a good one. It's not Cove Light. I'm trying to remember. I could just look, but no. Okay, let's look. Oh, baseline. That's right. Did I get enough of it off? Yep. Baseline. <laughs> wow. It looks terrible. But you know what? This one. Uh, I'm saying it looks terrible. I don't know if you can see on camera, but in person, just terrible. And the holes right here, you can see just paint caked in there and it's sticking to the body. Uh, but at least this one's going to roll. Am I going to get a spine buster that rolls? Let's see. <laughs> Man. Uh, ugly. At least it's not sticking to the bag, right? It's moving. Let's see. Uh, might roll. 
might roll, might roll, might roll. Let's see. Check the wheels. <coughs> look, look, look. Can you see this sticker right here? The paint it just globs it on there. Oh, it's terrible. Uh, how many bad words have they used so far? Not bad as in bad language. I mean, terrible, disgusting. Number four. Number five. Number six. Oh, yeah. It looks green like pea soup. Yum. Actually, now that I look at it again, it's, it's pretty close to that yellow. It's like a yellow with a little bit of orange and greenish kind. Well, of course, duh. So these are not in order. I just I just wash them in the sink to get them mostly clean. They're not perfect. There's gonna be spots. See, look, you can still you can still see the green on that one there. Put it in this water. So far, the warm water has not caused a change. That's basically if you're gonna wash them in tap water. It's pretty much what you're gonna get. Look, no no change. I'll go ahead and pull out, put all of them over here just in case. Green. White. Oh. What's left? Power rocket, I believe. And there's another RD08, I think. Here we go. RD08. The deco on the side. Just kind of an orange splash pattern. Wait a second. Is that the same car? Yeah, it's the same car. But it doesn't have the same deco as uh, the color shifter in the single. I should open it. Huh. Let's go ahead and pop it in there. What color? Oh, went orange. I wasn't going to open it, but just for you. Here we go. So cold water. Oh, this one was already the cold color. Mm, I don't know if that's warm enough. Let's see. There you go. Back to white. Back to dark. Let's see. Are they the same? No, they're not the same. Deco on the side. Nitro tailgater. And the decoration looks just kind of spotty like this. But I'll bet you something's going to appear when you put it in the cold water. Two, three, four. There you go. It has flames. Let me show you a little closer. Don't forget, I didn't clean it all the way. I just want to hurry up and get this done for you. Here's the normal graphics on the side. Hot Wheels flame logo. Let's see how speed box changes. Did he fart? I swear I seen a fart. That's an interesting color. It's kind of plum, kind of a plum color. Are you ready? And what happened to the hot? It just has wheels. Does it say hot wheels on the other side? Hot wit, wit, and then the wrist is gone. Ready? Blue. Looks good with the yellow interior. Hot. Wheels. I wonder what the graphics are going to be on this one. Baseline, pretty cool. Blue, light blue, and pink. Oh, went to a greenish color. Greenish. It's a dark green. And then when you look inside, wait, let me get the water out. Then when you look inside, mm, I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. Last up, my car. Yep, Spine Buster. My favorite Hot Wheels Fantasy Model 2 Collect. Ready? Cold water. Ooh, nice color. Purple. Very nice. Uh, purple, violet. Very nice color. I like it. So if you get these, remember, they're not like the normal color shifters. When you take them out of the package, you have to clean them off. Thanks for watching. Have fun. Bye-bye.